but he had to say his place and move the table forward. So just enough to get the three positions. So I get my uh, my point, I get my signal, and then we just it's not just ringing, it's not fashion, it's not like hidden, yeah. it's safe to cover the right thing. I'm going to make the same motion as we did before. We go up. Only now that's us hold. Yes? I keep my hands low because I'm lazy. Yes? I'm going to leave it off. So I just, if I go up there, it's doable, but why should I? Because if the bind is hard enough, here, as it pushes my blade here, I can just go here. Okay? So, again, same motion, you want to go one, two, and then only he changed the distance, he changes the distance in which he wants to die in, so, there, signal, here, and just turn here. Just, so, just a question, yes. uh, isn't the uh, safety of the head uh, a good reason to go up with the hands even for a lazy guy? Um, okay, let's test this. So, again, I go here. Yeah? Why is my head less safe than when I'm here? Um, because he can, he can move from, from the blade and... and to yes, but he, he can also move from the blade when I'm here. Yeah? So, I'm, I'm counting on the hard mind to get my safety. This is also the reason why I do not use my footwork. Because um, if I'm in the first and I step forward before I make a strike, it could be a weak bind. Yeah? I want to be sure that this blade is out of the way. So I first move my blade, I can use my hip rotation, push, and really strike hard. Here, there. Now I know it's safe and I can step in. If he wants to change his pressure on the blade, by going weak again, I can just bind it again. Yeah? And now, this is the easy part, because if I want to apply there, and I want to apply it here, I have to make a more difficult move. But now, I can just go here, and go here. Okay. Yeah? It's easier for me. Like I said, I'm lazy. Yes? Okay. So, uh, we like to build up exercises in stages. This means the first stage still counts. So, if he pulls away his blade and I hit him, I'm done. Yeah? Rest of the day off. So. Hit. Perfect. If he makes it to the set, I move back. Yeah? I'm just going to make the same exercise in the same motion. If he now also makes it to the set and stays in the position, I make the same motion. Yeah, and hit him here. Okay? So, all three things can happen. But try to also practice the third one. Yes? Okay. Okay, change partners, exercise. Uh, so, we're going to add one more distance. We're going to go into the first ring in distance. And uh, the manuscript says if his hands are not too high, make an uprising. So, rip it down. Yeah? Ice is up. Okay. So, if my opponent yeah, gives a signal, yeah, wants to make a strike, and he steps forward here, and then he touches his arm, I'm going to make the same motion, make a hole But now, I'm going to make it on this side of the blade. So, I move my pommel over his hands, there, I'm going to make this motion. Please be careful, because this is a very powerful strike especially when you push with the right hand. So you can easily injure or um, get a concussion on your training partner. That's not what we like. So, from here on, there, step forward. This is his ringen, arm ringen. So I'm gonna make the same motion I did before. Yeah? One, two. One, two. Yes? Again, I'm safe because my hands are across the line. There, and rises up, yeah. ripping his sword off, of line, there, using his hands to pull him into my blade, and I'm hitting him here. So, safe, stable structure in the end. And from the other side, go here on, get the signal, distance, arm linking, we step forward, take the same motion, and go here. This move, 
pushing the right hand. So this is the structure, this is the motion there. It's a very powerful strike. Okay? So, these things can happen. Then, I get it closer here, I make the 
same motion. There, if it goes a little higher. There. What is this is called? Okay. Unterschnitt or Ansetzen, yeah, whatever you like. There. And then we can do the same one. There. If it goes up here. There. We'll make the door top. Yeah, and rest again. So, without further ado, same exercise, but now we're going to do here, here. Yes? Try this. So, on one line. Yeah, one, two, three, four. Okay. So, I'm going to be the common opponent. So, they're going to attack me with Kevin Omaha. I'm just going to change the distance. I'm going to move back. I'm going to move forward. I'm going to stay in position. And you have to solve whatever I'm throwing at you. So, let's do it nice and slow. I'm just going to stand here. There, let's go in position. Here. Okay, perfect. Next one. There. Strike. Okay, hit. Perfect. Next one. So we did 10 techniques in one and a half hour and you didn't even know you were doing them. Yeah? So this is when you distill everything down to a simple motion, just going this, this, or this, this, techniques will happen. Just observe the distance. Just observe what your partner is doing. Is he hitting me? Is he stabbing me? Is he changing to a position? What, what's he doing? And if we have all this, we can just add it up. Yeah, one plus one plus two plus three plus one, one. And then you have technique. But techniques just happen. Don't try to force them. Go with the flow. Go with the flow. Yes. But again, this is this is German tradition. And for me, German tradition means Glückwunsch. Yeah. <laughs> Let's <Litsky. laughs> Just don't need any more while you're doing it. Yeah. So um, it's the most simple motion that gets you safety, a good structure. And you can hit the opponent. And even if you don't hit the opponent, I'm still in a safe structure. So I can continue. I have the option to continue. No matter what it does. Because I'm safe. Okay. Um, I want to thank you very much for participating. I want to thank my fellow And if you have any questions, please, I'm available the whole day. If you want to spar me, talk to me, talk to Michelle, have questions about the workshop, just go. Explain. Yeah, I didn't get it, or uh, I disagree. We are here for you. Yes. So thank you very much. Same position, 
I'm going to take the line again instead. Yeah, maybe we see my foot a little bit. It's going to take the line instead. So try to avoid going out and in and out and in again. Yeah. If it gets weird, so if you go here a little bit, yeah, then just step back, start again. Yeah. Take the line. 